Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with Russian Fishing 4. It's been a while since I've been here. Lots of things going on with Fishing Planet and with reviews. Thought I'd come back and do another episode. The last time I was here, I was going after brown trout primarily. Did do a little carp fishing too. I thought I'd come back out here and try to see if this fishing spot was still. Holding out. I think it was right over here, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, the fish do move, so sometimes one thing works, sometimes it doesn't work the next time. Alright, let's see. This is the spot, I think. Yep, this is it. We're gonna try right here again, because there's that rock. I think it's number four, is this one? Yeah, oh no, that's actually the Sorrento, but we are going to go ahead and throw the bottom rods out. We might have some luck getting some big fish, like maybe some catfish. Wait, do I have the clip on again? I mean, it is possible. Wait a minute, let me see how big that thing is. Let's see, 14, that's not very heavy. We need something that's going to send the thing out there. There we go. Yeah, I'd love to get something different fishing with this method. This one I don't have the gear set up on. Fix it. This is it. Yeah, I've got fish pieces on one. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Shoot. Line clip again. Yeah, I was fishing for carp the last time I used these rods, so... Now we got some distance. See if we can't get something off an earthworm. Alright. And now I'm... God bless it, I keep... grabbing the wrong rod. Five is it. Alright, now I think... I don't remember where I threw it last time. I think it was right over there. Towards that rock. Now we're using a hornet number two, I believe. I'd like to have the hornet number one, but... It's expensive. This one happened to be gifted to me, so it should do all right. I think the only difference is it might be a little bit heavier. That's about it. Here, a trout, you kind of want to let it sit on bottom for a second before you reel in again. current is really strong. Yeah, let me see here. 
gets 12 grams. It is a spinner bait. But I do not have anything. I have a Zymon. I don't have the Hornet. And that is the one that is supposed to be the real killer when it comes to the brown trout. Now, I was having a little bit of luck with some others, but let me take a look again. Because you can find what's working with them by going to the records and ratings. You just go to Beluga River once it comes up. And then you look for whatever you're going after. Like, you know, Bleak, apparently they're going after uh, flies and pearl barley. Brown trout. Looks like they're going for the hornet, like I said, number one. And the spiker number two. Zero eighteen. I wonder if I have that one. Yeah, I do. Let's try that. Now, it doesn't mean this is where they are right now either, though. That's another thing we gotta consider. The last time I caught a decent sized one. Yeah, this is a lot lighter. Spinner bait. Like I said, these guys move. And it was well over a month ago that I had spoken to the Canadian Way. He helped me out quite a bit, but he's on this thing all the time. I've been primarily focused on Fishing Planet because of its Halloween events and I've been doing a lot of reviews. Yeah, the reviews get you free games, guys, and you get the chance to try some new stuff and see what people like. Get exposed to some different things. Yeah, this is not casting out very far. Yeah, later on, you can actually add sinkers to these things, and that's something I really wish I could do. Ooh. Holy crap, I am getting a bite. Let's see if he does that again. Well. When do you know it? As night gets close, we should start getting more bites. Well, I'm not having any luck with this one. Just not getting any action. And it's supposed to be a good one. Let's try the red one. Spiker number two. Sometimes the red ones do really good at night. Yeah, I'm gonna have to check to see if I have anything for Xander. a snag. Yeah, that's kind of the downfall of being right there. We're going to have to move over just a little bit so we don't get caught up on that rock. Well, the sun is going down. Since the 
sun is going down, we need to come up with something for Xander. Yeah, I think I might try recasting these. Should be right in the hole. I think I might put a bigger sinker on this one too. Yeah, that doesn't help a whole lot. <laughs> what size sinker do I have on here? Oh, not a very big one. But 60, 60 grams will give me some more distance. Oh wow. Very nice. Longest cast. Let me see what I have as far as Xander type of lures. This should be one that would be interesting. Here's one, a handmade for Xander. Yeah, and I have caught them with this, at least in the past. But I think I need to come down a little bit because you got to be over the hole. And you got to make sure you're right over that hole. Actually, let's do this too. Let's go ahead and pull these up. We're going to move over here. Yeah, this spot is just either dried out or just isn't doing anything. Oh, I did get that out of good ways. Yeah, it looks like we gotta find us a new spot, cause it just... Nothing was biting on either type of rod. It's like one time, and then it quit. Yeah, there used to be a good spot just right over here. Right near these tents. There was these rocks over here. We used to just cast right out there, we used to catch Taman. I don't know if it's changed. Let me see here. Yep, that should get me right out there in the hole.
Now let's see what we can do with this Xander lure. The gist is it's supposed to be able to go right over the hole. I do know they like a slow retrieve. Am I getting a bite? I am. It was uh, this one, I believe. Oh, something's definitely messing around with that. Come on. Alright, I'm just going to keep an eye on it. I was going to say, God bless it. Alright, we got something here. We definitely have something. It's not huge, but we got a bite on the other one, too. Let's see what we got here, guys. Kind of curious. Yes, it's a burbot. It's not huge, but it's our first burbot here. Nice. Okay, okay. Another persistent little fella. Yeah, he's not huge either, but... this time we're getting them. Last time I tried to cast it out there, I guess I wasn't getting the distance I needed. I can deal with the Balaya River Burbot. Burbot. Balaya River Burbot? Shouldn't be that hard to say. Yep, there's another one. It's not a lot of XP, but they are kind of cool looking. You gotta, you gotta admit, they are kind of cool looking. Alright, let's throw it out there again. So they had no problem going for the Earthworms. Okay, we gotta get number four out there. Let her sink. Let's see if we can get us another one here, guys. I like some burbage. I just like to get a decent sized burbage, though. Okay, I'm starting to get a nibble again. This time, I hope. Well, I think he's on there. Yeah, he's on here. He's not big, though. Another small fella. Oh wow, it's a river mussel. Good size one. That could 
fetch a fair price. Alright guys, looks like we've got a bite. We're gonna go ahead and keep that. Hopefully we won't lose this. Ooh boy. This is This is a little bit bigger than what we've caught so far. I think we might have us a decent burbot or something else. He's coming. And he is fighting. Okay, he's giving us a little bit. Just about got him in here, guys. I think it's just a really big burbot. We'll see here. No, it's a monster perch. Good lord. Yeah, that, I love the way they've improved the graphics on this. I was sure it was something other than that. I was sure it was another burbot. Yeah, unfortunately I had to leave for a little bit, but this game, unlike Fishing Planet, it does not pause for whatever time you left off. It keeps ticking. It's got some kind of server clock, so... Which is actually sometimes a very big disadvantage for me, because sometimes I have to leave at a moment's notice. We're going to try throwing these out again. I know it's daytime now. We're having some good luck so far. As far as the other rod, I think I'm just going to come over here and try different spots. That's really about all I'm going to be able to do. There we go. Use a twitching action and got me a nice grayling. Maybe the stop and go is just not working now. Probably a perch. It seems to be the another decent perch. Actually, if we get enough of those, we could get some. If we get enough of those, we could get some money from the cafe. But I think I gotta get like five of them or something. here. There's another birch. Don't know if he's big enough. May have to go back to the cafe and check. They seem to be going for this gold lure that I'm using here. The gold's supposed to be attractive to fish in cloudy weather. I don't know if that's just a myth or what, but
guess we'll find out here. A few decent fish. There we go. It's probably another perch. Yep. Let me put this away for a sec. I am going to check the cafe and see what what their requirements are with the perch. I need six of them. They only have to be 50 grams. That shouldn't be too tough. So I've got four, I believe. Partly sunny. That may change things a little bit, though. All right, we got another one. He is small. Though. He still, he still meets it. One more. And we've got sunny weather again. Alright, now we got one. He's a little bigger. Quite a bit bigger, actually. I'm just gonna grab as many of these since I'm catching them if I can. The more, the merrier. And this one seems to be pulling in the perch. Let's try this fluorocarbon. I did have two spikers. I don't want to lose another one though. Let's see if the fluorocarbon does better with. Because it just occurred to me that the. the brown trout are skittish. Carbon is invisible. There we go. Decent grayling. Wow, really decent grayling. 1,114 points. Co XP, 1,155. Got a tipsy bonus. There we go, we got something here. I think it might be a, another grayling. Yeah. Not a big one. <coughs> Graylings seem to like the Zeman a lot. Getting to be nighttime. If we're gonna get a brown trout, this would be the time.
There we go. Uh, we got something here. It could be another grayling, but if it is, no big deal. Yeah, we're definitely getting grayling. Okay, he's a little bit bigger. No brown trout this time around, guys. It just don't seem to be biting. Is it another grayling or is it it is another grayling and it is a good size one that's the biggest one so far the grayling get a lot of xp if you can get them and i've been getting them Ooh, there's another one oh they're really out to get me here Will this break the last one? Yes, it did. So, total of 1,298 points. I don't know if I'll get any more at this point, but it's gotten dark. might be no you're not done now we got us a chub I must have cast into this thing a dozen times earlier and didn't get a darn thing now I'm getting pretty good bites Alright guys, I think it's slowed down now. I think we're getting bites based on the light levels and I think we're done. We have done pretty darn good, honestly. I am going to go to the cafe and check the prices of what these perch are going to bring me if I were to just sell them. Yeah, we're done. Because sometimes you could end up, you know, really doing yourself a bad favor because you could get, like I'm getting 15 silver for 6. If I sold them separately, I might end up getting, like, a lot more than 15. Wait a minute, what is going on over here? Okay, I must have had something on that. It's not there anymore, but he definitely took it for a ride. Yeah, we're gonna... Oh, holy crap, he's still on it. Well, one good thing is he's tired. <laughs> Let's see what he is. Is it another big old perch? Yes, it is. Perfect, that gives us some extra perch to deal with. Yeah, let me check this one, make sure there's nothing on it. 
I might recast. I think I might put some fish on the other one too. Let me pull that way out there. Alright, let's see what kind of deal we can get here. Well, first, let's go to the fish market. Alright, 175, 242, 308. Yeah, we're definitely going to get better going through the cafes. Man, I'm getting some good money for these crailing. Look at that, 11 to 42, 1094. Shoot, wish they had not much for the bourbon, unfortunately. Let's see what we get here at the cafe. River mussel was not big enough. Yep. The perch, however, were. We can sell them these smaller ones. That's how you do it, see, you guys. You smell, sell the small ones. They want six. That gets us. Fourteen twenty-nine, and that's all we can sell at this time. All right, I just want to be sure that I got. The, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and sell that other perch. You got three away. That's not too bad. For one perch. I'm going to sell the muscle. I can't really do much more with it. Might as well sell these graylings. Jeez. Some good cash here. Alright. Not too bad, not too bad. Yeah, now I'm not getting the bites I was getting. Yeah, I thought I was getting something on that. Just got to keep an eye on it. Yeah, I think we're about done. We're going to leave. Oh, wow. Where did he come from? <laughs> ah, a little pike. He came out of nowhere. Yeah, it's about ready to quit. Got a little pike. is right near that rock. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Another one? I don't know. No, it's just a really big chub. New message received, huh? Let's see what the message is. Takush. Well, hello, Takush. Let's see. Loving channel, keep it up. Just watching your channel now. Hope all is well. Things are a lot better. Thank you. Fishing has been a bit slow.
slow here at Alaya. I might not have time to put out a video until tomorrow night. Spots have changed on me. <laughs> Spots have changed on me. Lots of laugh out loud. Yeah, they did, fortunately. But just now got some decent fish right by that rock. That's kind of weird. I'm going to try that again another time or two just to see if I get lucky if I've kind of gotten to some kind of a apparently I have some kind of algorithmic deal <laughs> but I think that fish just got off actually yeah he did I'm not as big as some of these other guys that are out there, but people that do follow me are really loyal. And I seriously appreciate that. This is why I do it, guys. And we got... Well, that gun, he got off me again. What is the deal? Yeah, that's where I've been getting them. I think that's right over here, where I was getting them earlier. Right here. Yeah, we'll try it. I was doing good with grayling. Not with the Volkov bar. I was using... I was getting it with that one. Dragonfly Long 1. And not the Hornet. What was it? The Spiker. Red Spiker. Let's try the Silver Dragonfly. Since we've got sunny weather. Faster, about a I'm not sure which direction. Well, you little turd. That looked like a little chub. Aha! You're getting a bite. It's about time. Yeah, 
he might be having luck with him, but I'm not. Spiker, that's what I've got. That's exactly what I've got. <laughs> Not getting them. Let me try down here. I was getting them earlier. another. I've seen that happen too. We could be fishing exactly the same spot as someone else, but look at that. And if this is a grayling, I swear to God it is. That's uh, 72.65. Look at that. I just got another one. Isn't that the same thing as vodka? Holy crap. This is crazy. Another nice one. That went for it as soon as it hit the water. That gone. Twelve hundred points, twelve eighty four. That might be the biggest one yet. <laughs> 